The following is a fan-based discussion. All properties discussed are property of Toei Inc., Bandai, Hasbro, and Subarai Productions. Hello and welcome to another episode of Toku Cheers. Who will be crying today? <laughs> Not us, that's for damn sure. Mm. Green and blacks! Greens and blacks. Alright, and as you can see, we've already got the haven't seen up and done, so why don't we just get right into it. Let's do it. That old Kenya. He was great. I love that old Kenya. Kenji Oba. He's Kenji Oba. Even so, without Kenji Oba, he was a good character. He was a good, fun character who doesn't like poachers. So, B. I'll put him in a B. It's Real weird doing that for a battle fever character. <laughs> what, putting him that high? <laughs> yeah. <Too> much. <laughs> the only other, well, we what, might are use. what are your other options? <laughs> battle Cossack. Which one? The first one. And the second one. They were both good. They were, they were both okay. And the second Miss America. So she went from a D to a C. <laughs> I said the second one. Yeah, the no. first one. The first one was a D. The first one was a who? Because <laughs> she was in like nine episodes. <laughs> Great. Da. Great. Da. But besides that, <laughs> what can you say about his character? Not much. C or D or who? I don't put a note. I just don't remember anything about him. Who are you? Don't know. Copyright. Change Griffin. Copyright. Change motherfucking Griffin. Griffin. Oh. He gets at least a B. I love Change Griffin. His character did change actually quite a bit because he was always the sort of the womanizer. But um, oh. it, did you take? Did I take yeah, a second? He was sort of a womanizer. Pretty spear. Womanizer. Thank woman, you. Copyright. Uh, I'm really risking it in this video. C. I'm looking at that for Change Man. Okay, and these two. I'd put them both in C. Really? That high? Yeah. I'd put green in C and black in D. I would switch it because green gave me the worst uh, episode I've ever seen. Yeah, but it was memorable. It made... He did. He was more memorable than black. So I thought they were both fine. I thought they were both trash. So I'm going to put them both in D. Okay. I just... They didn't contribute anything. <laughs> That's because they were introduced too goddamn late. They were. That's... All right. Let's just all go ahead and agree. But the S. S. <laughs> it's Guy Yes, bro. So, Mammoth Ranger. Who? He was the older brother figure. Who? If you say so. Yeah, that's all the bad I got about him. And this is Power Rangers. It'd be a different. You could have told me he was the chef of the group, and I would have believed you. I think that was yellow. Dago. S. Really? S for Dago. He had a great storyline with Kujaku. He did. I mean, yeah, but he's a meme. That's fine. I mean, that S is fine. I just want to make sure that we explain. I think he's that. a great character. He is a great character. I, I just wanted, I wanted more explanation for why he deserves S other than in the Dago. Realm, in the realm of Die Ranger, well, Di Dago, yes, it's become a meme at this point, but his whole storyline with Kujaku and the fact that he's such a caring, loving person and how much he cares about animals and nature. And phoenixes. And, no, no matter how much he comes across. Also, she was a peacock. Um, yeah, just how he ends up coming across from a much more stringent, stoic character at the beginning of the show. Mm -hmm. That's fair. Yeah. Ninja Black. Ah, here's the problem with Jiraiya. The best thing he did was the story with his dad, or his master in this case. Mm -hmm. Outside of that, though. I was thinking C or B. I was... Thing in the DRC. I love his suit. But, but let me let me let me kind of put this in perspective. If you want to say D, that means he's on par with those. I two. know. I'm probably just gonna put him in C. That's fair. Because I did like that storyline, even if it did reflect life a little bit too much at the end of the day. Moving on. This is more you guys. Okay. Um. <laughs> Still more you guys. Car Ranger. Race he Green was Racer. the comedian. He was the funny one. I loved him. He was the funny one? He was hilarious. I mean, to be fair, they were all really funny. But I loved him. Where do you want to put him? D. That's okay. He made me laugh so okay. hard in this show. I am about to say, any other than B, we would have words. Mega Black. But Kenta. Above B. He was the actual leader of this team. Mm. I would put him in A. I would also put him in A. I'm okay with this. He was a good character. This is weird that I actually remember this character's name. Haike. Uh, Ginga Man? Yep. Yeah. I Ginga do not. Man. He was the older brother character. Again, not really much else he 
kind of contributed. Yeah. So, C? Yeah. Go green. As we should in our everyday lives. Or something. Um. <laughs> Terrible joke. It was only a slap. You know, you still care correct. about the environment or something. <laughs> <laughs> Go green. Um. Who? Yeah. Yeah. I remember him more as Delta. Who? Who's next? Ah, Time Green. I liked his character quite a bit. He was a smart one in that team. Either one B, of the smart ones. B or A. I don't think he's S-worthy. No, he's definitely not. But I love the storyline, of course. And he had the whole racism yeah. going with Or uh, rather the, the xenophobia one in this case. Yeah. It, I greatly enjoyed his character. It was, a, it was racism undertones. Yeah. All right. Okay. Who? Who? Yeah. This is Gal Black, by the way. Yeah, I know. I can't wait for us to do a Power Rangers version of this. It's going to be must see. Well, <laughs> no, I remember. I remember Iron Bison and Wild Boars more, more than, than I do this schmuck. Yeah, he'd be higher in this list. I remember him for different reasons. Um, because he was hot. Yeah, there, there it go. is. Uh, I'm very black. Oscar. A. S. Really? I would also yes. agree, yes. Okay, that's fine. The storyline I think really... he's a wonderful character. And... Y'all just remember, you guys remember Abba Ranger more than I do. He was, he was a great Most of the story ties into him. Yeah. Like I said, you remember him. And he, he, was, he was well written and well acted. Yep. Deck of Green. Ah, oh, I loved him. Sin I Chan. love Sin Chan. Sin Chan's great. Oh, he's such a good character. I would say, let me go think, and I'll think over there, but then I would probably break something. <laughs> like yourself. <laughs> Sin Chan. I mean, he could do a handstand if I held his legs up. Sure. I mean, yeah, that's with help, though. Um, <laughs> also, did he do a handstand or did he just bounce on his head? It was a handstand. Sin-san. It was a what? Handstand. No, that's not what you said, Mark. I said a Sin Chan. <laughs> to be fair, at the end of the day, it just basically became his. But. <laughs> A or S is I know A or S is fine with me. I love I just love him so much as a character. I think I'm gonna put him in S. Yeah. I'm gonna put him in S. He was great. He was he's such a memorable. Him character. and his relationship with Decca Pink was great. Even if outside of the show she did end up getting married to Decca Pink. So, I mean <laughs> I just love that's, that's her personal life. She she's a, it's funny because it seems like she's always dated or been married to a Senta actor. Because uh-huh. before that she was married to Red Racer. <laughs> Did not know that. Hmm. Makoto. Um, I I want to put him in B. I want to put him in B too. I'm okay because I liked him. I did like Makoto. He was great. I think that was his name. Close yeah, it was Makoto. Sweet. Ah, here we go. Hmm. Hmm. His he- story was interesting. I will definitely give him that. Coming off of a much more of an asshole character at the beginning. The to... story does not make the character. I feel like in this case, it's sort of asked. It boosts them. <laughs> boosts them if it's good. I'm thinking either B or A. I was thinking B. Because I don't know if he's on par with the two we have in A. That's true. Wherever Spider Man Okay. <laughs> Don't care. <laughs> oh, right. Uh, <laughs> Shinken Green. He was decent. He wasn't great. His character arc reminds me a lot of Boken Blacks. Who the heck was he again? Tiny Chiaki. He, he was the one who really did not like the fact that this was done before they were born. Yeah, he was the young. I think he was the youngest, other than Yellow. Yeah, it was the two of them were the youngest ones in the group. But it's just like he really rebelled a lot, especially at the beginning. But he also still had some great training marks, like um, he did. with the one that like the those roots that popped out of the ground. You had to race them. I remember nothing about it. I don't want to put him there. I don't know if he's that high. I think he is simply because of the you fact that you think he's better than Boken and Black Green Racer. Or yeah, you, you think he's on par with Mega Black? And, sorry, there's a fucking glare. Um, Time Green. Yeah, okay. solely because of the fact that him at the beginning of the show, I think his was done just a little bit he, better than Boken Black. He has a lot more growth. Yeah, yeah. Ha! growth in his look. <laughs> mm-hmm. 
Go say black. I really liked him, but he did not really contribute much. I agree. Yeah, he did not really do because much. Because... For his character or the show. Well, because his character was always tied to his sister. Yeah. With they my... were kind of a duo, which does, in these kinds of situations, oh, the <laughs> these kinds of situations makes it harder to judge him higher. Yeah. I think I would put him in B. I was thinking B or C. I was also thinking C. But I still Malibu and I, I mean... I liked him enough, but it's just I like... Still, I, don't, I think he's better than some of these. So I would put him in B. Because of Mal... Because just because he's more memorable than most people in C, uh, I just also think he's boring. We need plus and minuses. <laughs> we do. He's not that great of a character. It's just like, what did he do? That's why I want to put him in C okay. and not B. <laughs> hard to argue with that. <laughs> but but since that's a hard question because it's always. Unless you're they asking were about, the, they unless were there. You, and I'm more talking about like modern Sentai because this is modern, more modern Sentai. Because yeah. unless you're asking about the red, the answer is the exact same thing we just did. Not Silence, always. huh? Not always. More times than not, unfortunately. Yeah. Anyway, it depends on the show. Doc, Don, Don Lagoya. A or S? I put him. In I a. would not put him that high. I put him in A. I would put him in B. I put him in A. Why? Because he was he was memorable. Because because he was a fun character. He was a fun character. He was memorable. He was the he was. I'm trying to think. Find the words. Fun character. Memorable. I liked him more than those guys. He liked him more than those guys. Brought more to the table in terms of the team more than those guys. Because mm-hmm. he was the doctor. He was the cook. He was kind of the moral compass. Because three of them didn't he give a shit. He provided a lot of comic relief. He did provide a lot of comic relief. And I also like to point out, um, he saved his entire team single-handedly in one, in one episode. Well, not single-handedly. He did get some help from Marvelous at the end. But I'll put him in A. Yeah. Ah. Uh, wait, this is out of order. I was going to say. <laughs> All right. Uh, Cody Green and Cody Black. Cody Green, no higher than C. I'd put Cody Green in... He didn't do much. I'd put him in D. D. There we go. <laughs> I said no, but I think Black needs to be higher than him. I would put Black in... I would say C or B. I'd put him in C. I would also put him in C. I'm okay with that. Tokyo... He was a diet version Sango. of that. <laughs> nope. Yongo. Yongo. Thank you. I don't remember nothing. Who? Rewatching this now, especially because I'm going through yeah, it. Yeah, same. I still don't really remember much of the time. I put him in who? His character, you, you want to know what his character was? He, he plays with a kendama. Yeah, he was. That's was all, he, that's was all he, he also gets. supposed to be like the serious one? No. Yeah. Was he? Yeah. Because that's, that's not what I get. I get it from him. He's supposed to be the serious He's not, one. In comparison there to is, everybody else. There is a difference between being serious and having nothing to do. But his archetype was still supposed to be the serious one. Unfortunately, it was taken over by you. I, I disagree. I think it was taken over by you. I don't feel like he's serious at all. I just feel like he has resting bitch face and they gave him nothing to do. That doesn't make you serious. So that one martial arts episode where for some reason Wright was better than him. I have a problem with that. We'll get to it when we get to the review. Um, Next. Yikes. Okay. That's Zuo... Elephant Man. Yeah. Zuo Green. Zuo Levanto. Yikes. Um, Yikes. I don't know what it is. We're going to keep this in show. Wait, why is it yikes? Because, because his, re- his actor like ran over an old woman. He came back and like did stuff after, but he still got arrested for it. Because he did run over somebody and run away in the first place. Um, still, not a great character, though. He was okay. actually the most boring out of the cast. Oh, no, absolutely. Except for like that... like Didn't he have like a romance building with Tiger? No. no. Okay. <laughs> Ah, Oshi Black. I loved him. One, two, three. Moo! I loved him. But he didn't really bring much to the table. He did because of Stinger. They all had like their own little subsections. I'm thinking. B? I'm thinking B or C for this guy. Yeah. I'm thinking B. I want to put him in B. Because he quote unquote died for a bit. Her, on the other hand, Chameleon Green. Um, I remember her teacher in the Loot Pat Q uh, Zoo movie was Ninja White. Cool. <laughs> but uh, in show... Wasn't she a princess? 
No. I could have sworn she was like somebody important on her planet. That was Ahi. <laughs> you could be thinking of Ahi. Well, no, I just remember. <laughs> I remember no, she wasn't. She was never really that important. I, but like on her planet, I no. thought she was like the heir to something or other. That's all she was, the heir, because she didn't really provide much. But what it, uh, <laughs> motherfucker. Aaron provides a lot. I don't really remember much of it. I didn't like her. No, it's she's there. who. No, she's who. Yeah. She's a who. I didn't like her. Ah, uh, Patrin Michigo. What did he bring other than that one crop? Patrin, other what other now? than that one gender bent episode, what did he bring to the table? <laughs> that episode was hilarious. You never finished the show. No, I didn't. I'm just okay, so this is where you want to put him. I'm, sorry, what, but I'm, I'm literally asking, other than the gender bent episode, what did he bring to the table? He was the one who really, especially with uh, him and having a crush on Yellow so much, really ended up bringing those two teams together. Okay. I felt like he. I was about, I was going to start. I was going to then. I was about to change my question. Okay, what did he bring other than some awkward sexual tension for, uh, for plenty of I feel like just because of the fact that he was always, you know, trying to court her, for lack of a better term. Uh, yeah, but the guy, but uh, Ryu sold gold to make it better. <laughs> is, is he? Yeah, because he's, but he, because he knows, anyway, we'll get into that. So, but anyway, uh, I'm just trying to make sure you think of everything. I'm going to put him, because of the fact that he was actually the le- Grimmel. He what? Okay, um, <laughs> he didn't, I want to put him Okay. These two. Tell um, about Bamba. I want to put them both in C. I want to put Toa in C, Bamba in B. Really? Why Bamba in B and Bamba has... B for Bamba? I wasn't. I was thinking it, but I wasn't. I felt like his story was just a little bit better. He has more to do with the actual background story that ha- that is going on because he met uh guy sword before this he knew the whole thing about Nada, even though it ended up being more toe's story uh, a little bit at the end he has a lot more background with the things that are going on yeah but we're we're not really being shown any of it we're being told hey i knew this guy no we were shown it mostly we're, flashbacks no but we're shown very very few pieces of it like his background with nada we saw like two background like two flashbacks I think totaling about 70 seconds. But it was also thanks to him that he realized who Guy Sorbo was. Valid. But that's not a character that's an exposition dump. Also, him at the beginning of his show to him to now. That is fair. Those are two very different characters. Toa didn't like that, but Baba took a bit. Well, Toa's younger, and they're more impressionable. I mean, it's a couple hundred years. Uh, <laughs> they're all over a couple hundred years old. So. But Toa is still technically younger, so he is more impressionable. I'm but, still going to put him... Oh, no, him. I'm not saying you're wrong. <laughs> I'm going to get bump up. All right. Here is our list. We have more S's here. Which is, yeah. A lot of A's, too. I like Ooh. the list that we have. I like this list. This is a good list. Part of me would like to have um, Shoryu Black higher, but I definitely understand why he's at C. He was good. a good character, but yeah. It's mostly just, it's a fault of the show. Yeah, it is. It's a fault in their stars. There we go, there we go. No, it wasn't two. No. It's still a <laughs> stupid reference. <laughs> Let us know what you think of our list in the comments down below. How many tiers did we... I uh, almost said how many tears do we toku? That, that doesn't make sense. I'm so tired. I'm going to go play more Pokemon, guys. Bye. Don't forget to join us with all the things. And next time we'll be doing... Uh, Something else. The Ah, uh, the writers. The extra writers. The ones for the movies and such. Good night, everybody. <laughs>